2021 Super Aeronautique G23. This is the JL Audio demo boat. Love this setup, super simple, yet just classy. An all mystic white hall, interior deck, tower, and trailer. It's a triple axle boatmate trailer with uh, 18 inch bronze wheels. Just matches this whole scheme just perfectly. So really, really great looking package here. Um, this boat has 77 hours on it. It's a one owner, again, demo boat. Um, it does have a big three-step ladder with the handlebars, or actually a four-step ladder uh, with the side handles and a spare tire up front. Um, this boat is gonna have our docking lights up front here on the underside of the rub rail. Uh, also did gro uh, gold Chromax lettering. You can see there's some accents on that actuated tower in gold as well. But just a really great looking boat. Super clean, simple. And it is basically a fully loaded boat. Um, the only thing I can think of that it doesn't have would be like the 600 horsepower motor. Has the, This one has the ZZ6, which is a 6.2 liter 450 horsepower motor. Um, beyond that... It's pretty much got everything else. And we'll go through the interior here shortly. Um, trailer's gonna have big steps on the transom. We've got the straps and on the boat, fully decked out underwater here with a pair of underwater lights. We've got the surf pipe. We have Nautique integrated steer assist optioned on and ladder on the underside of the platform obviously we're going to have nautique surf system and the ncrs system on there as well um look at those nss blades massive moves a ton of ton of water look down the hall you can see straight down um this thing just pushes so much water out of the way and throws an amazing wave it's got 2200 pounds of ballast in it and 2021 was the first year for this new haul. So biggest improvement on the new haul, in my opinion, would be the surf wave. Um, so it's macking, uh, it fills pretty quickly. It's only 2,200 pounds. And um, the boat is in like immaculate condition. Um, I think really the only thing to point out is there's a little um, chip right there in the white, which really, doesn't stick out much at all um, and beyond that I mean it's pretty much unscathed it's only got again 76 hours on it 77 hours on it I'm walking around here just doing a quick lap um, cool little touch on the trailer is it does have the JL audio logo jetted into the frame and let's go ahead and hop on the interior all right, we have Sahara, ha Sahara sand as our main color on the interior. It's gonna have uh, mocha brown true weave as our one of our accents. Our piping is in mocha. And then we have um, Mystic White Softmax as one of our color panels and just a few small areas on the boat you can see over here and then we'll take a closer peek in a second but there's some jail audio branding on the floor there um, transom on the G's are gonna have these nice comfy big seats on the back here a couple cup holders transom remote for the stereo of course this is gonna have all the stereo options available for um, the G series boats. We've got the cooler in the back, gold Chromax across our transom steps here, and we've got these wonderful, nice, even steps leading us to the walkthrough, which in turn leads us all the way down into the interior of the boat. Um, the interior on this is immaculate. Like, I can't find any real significant signs of wear other than 
the steering wheel, <laughs> it's not that it's damaged or, or, or anything like that. You can tell a brand new steering wheel from a, a used steering wheel. And it's just kind of the material, you know, it's gonna get a little bit worn, just like in your car. Um, so you can tell the difference there. But beyond that, the interior's in really, really nice shape, um, leading us into storage in the back here. Tons and tons of room, all the ballast to subfloor. We've got these really nice rope hangers slash life jacket hangers in the back. And um, yeah, that's room for all your boards and gear you could imagine in the back of a G, which is one of the really biggest uh, uh, benefits of going with the G23 over its competitors and actually some of the other boats in the Nautique lineup. It just has the most storage. There's our ZZ6. It's freshly serviced, um, new impeller, fresh fluids and filters, and uh, just had it out on the water. Thing runs great. It's still under warranty through spring of uh, 2025, and that is also included with the boat, whereas you normally have to pay to transfer that. All right. Pop it inside real quick. Let's look at the tower. This does have the actuated tower option on. So it's power fold, folds backwards. Um, loaded up with the um, Nautique strapless board racks. And then up top, four JL 880 tower speakers with the covers. And then we have Nautique Bimini top. At the very top there, Nautique awareness cameras on here. Got the rotating um, tow point on the tower as well but uh, pretty well loaded up here on our tower accessories. Here's the speaker. But the nice neoprene covers that go on nice and easy. Um, let's check out the rest of this interior. One thing I didn't mention on the back, is you're gonna see these four kind of carbon fiber looking poles. Those are for the aft and forward sunshade. So this has the extended sunshades that clip on to the trailing edge of the tower cover all the way back out um, over the platform and then same thing in the bow of the boat so it has all the sunshades option on it nice uh, storage continuing all the way through into the back same thing on this side here let me flip up all of our seats here so Starboard side, flip up seat like so. Our rear seat with the step on it is this handle down below here. Just pull up on it and boom. We've got nice wake view seating in the interior of the boat. Lastly, flip up seat right there. When you're done, flip these things down goes right back into its place nice and sturdy um, oh I did want to talk about the sea deck so we do have JL audio logo on the flooring side inlays you can have your six um, speaker grills for the interior speakers we've got phone holder tray right here um, gold chromax inlays and then some sea deck with the um, kind of hashed pattern on it let's get a close look at that true weave i love this stuff this kind of breaks up the monotony of the kind of the, just the same plain solid color uh, materials that that uh, you see in a lot of boats this gives it a little bit more depth than obviously this great stitching you see all throughout the boat which is in white um Love seat, this is heated. We have a heated driver's seat. Somebody's calling me. There we go, meet that. Um, heated driver's seat, heated love seat. You can see we've got the pocket door air dam that comes across there through the bow. And then this does have the pop-out heater outlet option on it. So all the climate features on this G23. Um, driver's seat is adjustable. So you've got the bolster here on the bottom that lifts up if you want to. Um, and then you have sliding and rotating features there. Before I jump over into the helm, we have all of our storage under here. So we got our trash can. Actually, I didn't even notice that the mirror wasn't on. <laughs> I 
I think he took that off uh, when, uh, when we were towing it. But uh, the mirror, it's got the oversized mirror on it. We'll get that put on. Um, and then you have your stereo all up under here. So all your amps, 12 inch sub. This has the Studio Elite package. So you've got 12 inch sub there, 12 inch sub under here. And lastly, you've got wavefront speakers up here underneath the windshield on both sides. So again, fully, fully loaded stereo on this on this G. And nice little surprise is that this boat has the, let me turn on everything. This has the 2022 software upgraded on it. So um, just a whole different visual on the screen. I think it's a lot easier to use. Um, just better UI. I mean, with as time goes on, um, they've learned different things in terms of like feedback on their overall layout of their link screen and have improved on that. So got our stereo, um, all our lighting, climate features, ballast. Um, the wake shape is so much easier to tweak your surf and wakeboard wake here with this dial. Kind of gives you a visual on what you're doing as you adjust. And then um, I talked about lighting. This does have the enhanced courtesy lighting package. So all your cup holders are lit up in here. Pretty well a fully loaded boat, guys. Um, and then lastly on the helm over here, you have a fire, uh, wireless phone charger and this nice big shelf down below for storage. All right, coming up into the bow. This does have nice wraparound seating, the G's flatter bow shape. Opens up the seating a lot here. Um, if I open up our air dam walkthrough, you're gonna see this does have the Fender Pro option, so we've got all six fenders included with the boat. Fender Pros clip into these little uh, um, ports here on the top part of the boat on the gunnels. Storage under both sides. Um, got the cover under here. Actually, I might as well just open it up. Got the full cover stashed away, which is really nice that it fits up there. Bow filler cushion. You can flip it over both sides. Um, one side's the cushion, other side's sea deck. So if you want to walk in and out of the boat from the bow, so you trailer this thing a lot, um, saves your seats. And then we have the armrests up here too. So those are super cool to have. Last couple things to touch on, it does have the Sirius antenna. Again, talked about it having all the available stereo. It has everything you can get. GPS puck for your speed control up front. We've got our cooler here in the floor, which I forgot. You got the full cooler, matching cooler. Yeah, I mean, it's just a really nice setup. G, tons of space, tons of seating room, storage, all the best features Nautique has to offer, and just a wake throwing monster. So, if you want to come check it out, this thing's in immaculate condition. Again, 77 hours on this 2021. Check it out in our showroom. Come give us a visit or give us a call for more information at 317-845-9253. Thanks for taking the time to check out this beautiful G23.